month date, date difference function. <coughs> Let me check. Today is seventh, then it is saying next seven month date, current date, right? So in that case, you can no, no, take... to just put the minus because we are going back, not forward. That's what that's what that's what, that's what I'm going to do. I know that. <coughs> it's saying September, October, September seventh, October, November, December. Okay. So it's it's the it's saying uh, this variable is taking last. Six months data back. Okay, so R month is a function which through which you can get a date from past or future. Okay, like this year also. <coughs> so this variable, this variable, you will just call it. Call <coughs> date is equal to you need to write greater than equal to okay so how to write greater than equal to in set analysis in the bracket and how to pass the variable okay so this you need to see greater than equal to would be single quote greater than sorry <coughs> Greater than equal to and then upon percent and percent greater than equal to then dollar then instead this equal to v the variable name what was the variable name Yes, yes, yeah. Yeah, okay, okay. You daddy will look at that. I was just muted actually. My key was coming here. That's right. Here you will not get uh, uh, intelligence. Okay, so now you see the condition. Uh, you will get zero because we don't have last six months of data. We have up to 2015. Okay, so uh, order date is equal to and greater than equal to. So greater than equal to there is no operator in uh, clicks uh, in, in in set analysis. So you can write equal to. And then inside the single code, you have to pass greater than equal to or a date is greater than equal to. Then I'm making it dynamic. I'm not going to make it uh, static. I'm using dollar to pass a variable and in the bracket equal to the variable name. There's no expression error. It is perfect. Then apply. It will show you zero. The data is showing. Okay. <laughs> Suppose I would have data. Uh, my data is up to how many days? We have the data of 2015. So this will not come actually. It's 2000. Uh, so how many months we can go back? 
30 months no uh, one month just take any chart okay bar chart like that take know. any chart just, just, uh, no i'm trying to show the data here say okay. months yes yes hold on hold on yeah. i will show you the uh, let me just show the expression first then the expression be correct and showing the same thing into the chart is not a big deal actually I'll just show this in the bar chart and the sales price expression okay this is the set analysis expression where we're writing order date is greater than equal to six months back now why it is showing zero why it is showing zero because the date format which we have is and this is 7 march 2014 now our date format is something different we have just given here as DDMMYY. I need to change the date, data loaded. Also correct. Not showing record because for last six months I don't have any data here. And for last six months I don't have any data. It's the, I just changed this to 16. Suppose. 70. 70 means how many years back from now it is eighty four months back seven march two thousand twelve and then order date Order date and so order date. <coughs> Master item. Okay, why it is not matching? Because my date format is a little bit different, so that's why it is not matching. So I need to change it to MM DD. Why, 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 why? Then it will work. <coughs> you got my point, right? M. <coughs> this is the date format, and this is the format which is coming here. M, <coughs> B, Y, 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 Y. Then only it will work. How much we have changed this? So the format was not matched. Now I will load it. should be working but I don't know why it is
not matching this behavior. <coughs> Suppose I'll simply uh, take a static data just just for say uh, also, uh, uh, seven seven two zero one two okay from there onwards I would like to show the ones. Oh, still it is not working. <coughs> yes, that is working. So it is showing the data from 2012 to now. I'll just make it dynamic. It was it was only double quote with single quote, so that's why it is not validated. Now it's to this. I will just quote it. Now this is the dynamic one. So it is taking me five years down the line. Uh, uh, yes. The more you change the variable, the data will be uh, coming up. So it is uh, the data of year 2000. Uh, and we have, year 2010 we have, but if I just click on, showing the data from the uh, that particular date rolling rolling months so i just went to 84 months uh, eight, uh, eight years back okay means 2011 onwards so it's data is showing 11 onwards if you just change it to 16 means five years back then it will Five uh, years back, that will show to the data and more. <coughs> the data is changing accordingly. So this is what. So uh, it is just to change in a variable, and uh, if you have live data, if you have latest data, you can simply make it six minus six. So it will show you the data. But now, as as we don't have data of last six months. It is not showing. This is how the rolling month works. Okay. <clears throat>